Fighting for breakfast. I can't. I have to go to church. Oh. Well, well, after church then. Come on, we haven't seen you for so long. Baby, to get sick. It's so cold out. Come on. Okay. Okay. You come? Oh, yeah. You put the whole thing on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Table, I don't know you anything, baby. Okay. Mm. 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 Something's going on with him. I'm worried. You keep saying that. I think your um, I think your material instincts might be kicking in.
But in all this world, there really is only one law. We need never ask, Lord, what should I do? Because the Lord has told us what to do. Love one another. That, my friends, is the one true law. Love is God in action. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with you all now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. I turned to drop them off at the hospital. You know, you're, you're a good-looking fellow, Lars. Where's your girlfriend? I don't have one. Are you gay? My grandson's gay. I know all about the gays. I know, but I'm not gay, so... Well... Don't leave it too long. It's not good for you. Okay. Here. Give this to somebody nice. First start. Hello, Lars. tomorrow. Yeah, okay. Bye. Yeah, my brother's 27 years old. Maybe he wants to be left alone. That's not what he wants. Oh, really? Hey, go. How do you know that exactly? Because that's not how people are. Oh, there he goes. Lars! Come on, you promised! <sighs> Is that normal? Have a nice weekend. Ooh, that new girl's kind of cute, huh? You and Marco, what do you think?
Lars, Lars, you gotta see this. I'm not uh, really in the mood for porn this morning. It's not porn. Okay, it is, but check it out, all right? Huh? You like? Man, they're solid. Like, if she'd weigh 125 pounds, then she weighs 125 pounds. Is that right? You can customize everything. They got all these different heads and parts. You can design your own woman. Lars. Uh, Lars. Yeah. They're anatomically correct. You're not gonna buy one, are you? I wish. Look how much they cost them. Um, Wiped out from the new Xbox. Morning. <clears throat> morning. Oh, hey! Yeah, morning. Margo's here, everybody. Hooray. Yeah. put the hands in? Uh, we're the only ones from the lake. We could carpool. Uh, Lars, it's your day for coffee, buddy. Yeah. Well, your problem is, Margo, you're just too aggressive. Just chillax, you know? for dinner. Will you come? So I have to, I'll get in trouble. Yeah. No, you didn't. Yeah, did you no. That's my what? phone, I think. No, come on, wait, wait.
Okay. Karen's been worried about you. She thinks you've got a problem because you spend so much time by yourself. I'm fine. That's what I told her. That's exactly what I said. Dad was kind of like that too. So. Yeah, but he didn't really want anyone around, so that's the difference. It's not true. Okay, you know, yeah, sure, maybe after mom died, but yeah, he didn't know him before that. So. I mean, not that you could have, but I'm just. Just saying. Karen and I would really like it if you moved in. No, that's okay. Thank you. The house is half yours. Yeah, I know, but I'm fine. Thanks. Just put it out there. Good night. Sleep tight. Good night. Oh, wait. Here's some leftovers for you. Do you have my blanket? Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll get it. The... I'll get it. Just grab these. Be right back. It's a beautiful blanket. Gus says your mother made it for you. When she was pregnant. Well, she must have loved you very much. Like we do. Are you mad at me? Here we go. <laughs> Good night. Thanks. Good night. He's box for you. It's in the garage. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Bye. Thanks.
Hey. Come on in. It's okay. Is Karen gonna come? To the door. Karen. Yeah. Honey, come here. It's Lars. Yeah. She's just doing the, some kind of a it's pregnant women's yoga. So, that's good. Good, good. Stop. Hi. What's up? I have a visitor. Do you have a... Uh, Hello? Yeah. A visitor? Mm -hmm. It's great. Yeah. And she's not from here. She? Wow, what do you, what do you, what do you know? Did, where, where did you meet this person? On, on the internet? Yeah, well, everybody's doing that now. That's great. She doesn't speak much English, though. Uh -huh. It's okay. It's, it's, it's really the same with the guys at work. It's... It's not that big a deal. Okay. Um, well, yeah, well, you know, she's in a wheelchair, so I just don't want her to feel weird about it. So oh, no. I don't no. care. Okay. And uh, I have to ask you, really, I know that it's a really big favor. Yeah. Well, She's just really religious, and because we're both young and single, it just doesn't feel right for us to stay in the garage alone. Oh, wow. Yeah. We'll put her yeah. in the pink room. She can sleep here. In the pink room? Yeah. Okay. Put her. And there are new towels. <laughs> <laughs> Give us half an hour, you know, pick up and, 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 and get something in the oven. And okay, okay. Get the place ready. No! <laughs> See a little bit. You know, Bianca's um, a missionary. Well, it was a missionary, right? Sorry. Because she was raised by nuns. But now she's on a sabbatical so she can experience the world. Isn't that neat?
Are you hungry? You're starving. Can you give me a hand in the kitchen? How was that? Benson's crazy, right? He's crazy. I don't know. So you're never gonna believe this. Oh, makes me mad. Bianca's from the tropics. She, well, she's Brazilian. We're well, half Brazilian, half Danish, that's right. And somebody stole her luggage. Stole her wheelchair. That's terrible. <clears throat> yeah. Can you believe that, Gus? Yeah, I can't believe it. Right. Well, it's it makes me angry. Angry. Uh -huh. I wanted to ask you a favor. She doesn't mind. I promise. Well, Karen, you don't mind lending Bianca some clothes to you. She doesn't have any. Yeah. I'm not sure we're the same type, Lars. Well, that's okay, Karen, because Bianca doesn't really care about superficial things like that, so it's okay. I told you. Thanks. Well, this used to be my mom's room. So, if 
If you need anything, Gus and Karen are right across the hall. I'm in the garage. But you know that, so what else? Your towels are brand new, thanks to Karen. <laughs> <laughs> Lars, I, I think we should I think we should go to bed, you know? Oh, okay. Lars, I, I think right now I've been... Yeah. Okay, good night. Wait, um, that's not a good idea. Concerned about Bianca's health. You know, just with the traveling and and the change of climate and everything. And well, it's stress, you know. I'll make an appointment with Doctor Berman for tomorrow, for early tomorrow. We'll all go. Yeah, you remember Dagmar. Do you think that's a good idea? I do. I think we should do it. Yeah. That's a good idea because I was gonna go shopping for wheelchairs anyway. So, good night. Good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Natasha escaped from Moscow, where she was forced to strip from the Russian mob. Now all she wants is an all-American male to love. Midori left a high-paying job in Tokyo because she was unsatisfied as a woman. Tammy dropped out of high school to join the rodeo. The right cowboy to tame this wild filly. The doctor will tell us what to do. She's family practice. We're gonna need a shrink. No, she is. She's a psychologist too. Oh. She's 
says you have to be this far north. What do people think? We can't worry about that. Right. There's one my dad used to want. Our dad. That's the library. I have a car here you can borrow it if you want to. Well, actually, I'll have to take them out for you, but you just tell me. I don't know, actually, Gus. What was it that Dad did? Water and power. Oh. My job's at the school department. I miss everybody, but there's so much to do in the house. I'll go back just as soon as the baby's old enough and you're... Address. Then we're sleeping or country. That's what I would say. Slow. Is that serious? Could be. We'll have to wait and see. I want you to bring her in every week for special treatment. Can you do that? Yeah. Are you sure that that's necessary? Yes. Set that up with Joanne at the desk. Oh. I look forward to getting to know you, Bianca. Karen, I'm telling you, he belongs in a hospital. No. My Uncle Garth went to one of those places and he never came back. Yeah, 
But he needs more help than you and I are able to give him. I told you something was wrong and you wouldn't listen. If I may. Has Lars been functional? Does he go to work, wash, dress himself? So far. Has he had any violent episodes? Oh, no. No, never. He's a sweetheart. He never even raises his voice. Okay. We gotta fix him. Can you fix him? I don't know, God. I don't believe he's psychotic or schizophrenic. I don't think this is caused by genes or faulty wiring in the brain. So then what the hell is going on then? He appears to have a delusion. A delusion? What the hell is he doing with a delusion for Christ's sake? That's what we have to find out. Chances are he's been decompensating for some time. Guess we didn't realize. Have there been any changes in the family in the last year or so? No, everything is pretty much exactly the same except uh, that Karen is pregnant and Lars is nuts. You know, this isn't necessarily a bad thing. What we call mental illness isn't always just an illness. It can be a, a communication. It can be a way to work something out. Fantastic. When will it be over? When he doesn't need it anymore. How can we help? Go along with it. Oh, no. <laughs> no, that's... No. Oh, my. No, 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 no. No, I mean, pretend that she's real? I'm not going to do it. I mean, I can't. I'm just not going to do it. She is real. Well. I mean, she's right out there. Right, right. I, I, I get that, but I'm just not going to... You know, I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna do it, so. You won't be able to change his mind anyway. Bianca's in town for a reason. Right, but, but. It's not really a choice. Okay. Okay, all right, then we'll do it. Whatever it takes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And everyone's gonna laugh at him. And you. More coffee, Lars? Yes, please. Let me see your funny face. <laughs> Does Bianca want some? Yeah. There you go. My good girl. Just, no? Okay. Huh? Okay. Go to work today, Gus. I don't feel good. Oh no. Well, Bianca could help you, you know. She has nurses training. No, she doesn't. She doesn't have nurses training, Lars, because she's not a person. She's a big plastic thing. That's amazing. 
Did you hear that? Bianca just said that that's why God made her to help people. Are you gonna be late? For work? I am gonna be late. Oh, no, I have to go. Okay. But I'm going to check in. Okie doke. And you have my number at work, right, Karen? Yep. You feel better, Gus. Me too. And thanks so much for breakfast. No. Okay, you gotta go. Bye. See ya. Well, I had to try, you know. What? What? It's just, I don't know. It's true. It, we've been all wrapped up in ourselves. We have, Gus. This is not my fault, though. It's not my fault. Come on, Bianca, let's make a couple of calls. Thank you, old Mr. Sunshine. It's way in advance, but uh, <laughs> you know how excited I get about these things. All right, where are they? I know you took them. I did not. You did too. As revenge. For what? For the fake rat I put in your drawer. Oh, that. Lars, I'm missing three of my action figures. It's your turn to get coffee. Okay. Listen up, Margo. Those action figures are extremely important to me. All right? They're worth a lot of money. If I don't see every damn one back on my desk pretty soon, then you can tell your teddy bear to watch his back. I'll return them <laughs> one at a time. <laughs> Going to Cindy's party? Oh no. <laughs> I was hoping you would. I really I really wish you you would. Well maybe. That'd be great. <sighs> Do you think I could bring my girlfriend? Um, yeah, yeah, I mean, you know, I'm totally bringing somebody. Hmm. Wow. I 
didn't know there were sex dolls. Love dolls. That's what they call them. I saw special on cable. So you serious? The author really has a... Mm -hmm. So she's... She's really just one of the girls. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. El hombre se compró una muñeca que se infló. Le salen unas tetas así, el tipo se la come. Sale volando. No way. She have a sister? <laughs> We shot a woman, I couldn't talk. <laughs> It's not that funny. It's not that funny. We don't want anything to do with her. She's a golden calf. We all know what happened with that. Well, he's not worshipping her. They're just dating. These young people have no willpower. He's sick. All right. He's sick. Yes, we, we were just hoping if we came to you, you could help, you know, just paves the way a little. It, it, if you could just try to understand, it's... He is a nice I didn't man. I can try. Oh, my I don't even know why we're here. This is, this is... Oh, for heaven's sake, what's the big deal? Sally, your cousin puts dresses on his cats. Hazel, your new nephew gave all his money to a UFO oh. club. Everybody knows your first wife was a klepto. She wasn't. Then why is she buried in a pair of my earrings? Yeah. Now that's enough. These things happen. Lars is a good boy. You can depend on me. Thanks, Mrs. Greer. Well, he's not bringing her to church now, is he, Reverend Bach? Well, <clears throat> the question is, as always, what would Jesus do? the opportunity to welcome all of our new visitors to our church today. Bianca, good to see you. Morris, God bless. God bless. Thank you so much. You're welcome in here. Can you close? These are for you, Bianca. Thank you. Yeah, look, this is my friend, Mrs. Gruner. She has a darling figure. Those are nice, huh? They're not real, so they last forever. Is that good?
I'll get the chair. Oh, can you, uh, can you put a seatbelt on? Bianca, um, Gus is gonna put on your seatbelt, okay? Oh, can you get put down on her legs because she gets cold? Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, Gus. Yeah, where are you guys, uh, where are you going? Just one second. She doesn't know it's a secret. But I can tell you. It's just that she's asking me all these questions all the time, and she wants to know everything about me, so I thought that I would take her. Yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah. That sounds, uh, yeah, that sounds nice. Yeah. Okay. I'm coming. Why are you yelling? Gus and his friends just come up here all the time. And suddenly they go first. And then they play hockey. And they build all kinds of cool forts like snow forts. Watch me chop wood too. I'm really good at it. Dream and 
just to rest. Keep me company. Mars. Keep me company. Do you know how many sessions she's going to have to have? Don't is the tricky illness, Lars. But you know what I could use is a more complete history on her, like parents. Why did they die when she was a baby? Mm -hmm. Well, that's not fair. Yeah, but she doesn't feel sorry for herself or anything. She just. Wants to be normal, have everyone treat her normal. That's nice. I admire that. Yeah, me too. Is that your husband? Yes. He died. Oh no. I'm sorry. Do you have kids? No. You must get really lonely. Sometimes I get so lonely I forget what day it is and how to spell my name. <laughs> how about you? So what's the difference between a delusion and a hallucination? It's false perception versus false belief. Okay, so when Moose thinks the FBI is after him. The, yeah. I, and that's IRS, ATF, AAA. Right, that would be a delusion. Oh, dude, they are after us. Very lucky with women. She's wonderful. But she. We don't have to talk. Let's find you something to read. No, it's just. Between us. Of course. I'm worried about her. I 
think she has a little problem. Oh, maybe you shouldn't tell me. No, it's okay. It's just... And I think it's because she's insecure, but she's just always trying to hug everybody. You know, some people don't like that. Some people don't like to be hugged, but she doesn't realize that she takes it personally and thinks, uh, you know, it hurts her feelings. I don't know what to do about that. Do you? But it's such a comfort sometimes just to have somebody's arms around you, don't you think? No. Come on, it feels good. It does not feel good, it hurts. Oh. Like a cut or a, a, a bruise? Like a burn. Like like when you go outside and your feet freeze and then you come back in and they thaw out. It's like that. It's almost exactly like that. Same with everybody? But everyone else. So you don't let people touch you. Lars, isn't that hard to get away with? No, not really here because I have all these layers. And that helps. Look, we can't change Karen. But I can help you. That's fine. Pain. Yeah, but I can take it. Oh. You okay? Mm -hmm. That's enough for today. Well, it's scientifically proven that everyone's favorite word is their own name, so if you just say their names a lot, you okay? You can see that it's going to make them happy. Yeah. Mr. Sunshine, and this must be Bianca. Well, welcome.
welcome. Welcome, come on in. something to drink from the kitchen. Uh, Crane's Bianca. Does he have sex with her? Hey, that's what she's for. Yeah. Ew. Ew. So I hear you guys are getting married. No. Yes. Oh, take a Kill to have hair like hers. Oh, I'd kind of like to hear long in front, short in back. Lars would never let her cut her guys in long hair. I don't care. I don't know if she likes it. That's how I like it. That's my kind of guy. I need wine. Thanks. <laughs> oh no. Thanks. Get somebody better. What's that? Is she uh, flexible?
So he solaced himself with pacing up and down the little meadow and writing and carving on the bark of the trees and on the fine sand a multitude of verses, all in harmony with his sadness and some in praise of Dulcinea. What distressed him greatly was not having another hermit there to confess him. Do you ever want to be a mom? I don't know. Yes. But I'm not able to have children of my own. It's 
like that. When she was a baby, her mom died in the middle of things, so she was being born. Like yours. You have a lot in common. <laughs> You know, we've learned a lot since then. Things are, things are better. Yeah, but it could still happen, right? It's highly unlikely. It's, it's rare. Yeah, but it's still kind of... Lars, just take... Take a breath. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, it's just so dangerous. It's so dangerous. Lars, sit down. Put your head between your knees. Mm -hmm. Put your head between your knees. Sit down. Just, just, just put your head between your knees.
Hey. Hey. He's not going to get any better, is he? No, probably not. He's gonna love that thing. His whole life, and it's not my fault. No, it's not. It's... And I don't know. I mean, I left home as fast as I could. I never thought about him. And then the two of us moved back here all fat and happy. And he moves into the goddamn garage like that. I let him. No wonder he goes and orders a fiance in a box. Come Your banquet at the VFW. Don't she look beautiful? No, oh, she does. She looks beautiful. Hmm. That's because we were supposed to play Scrabble. Are you sure? Yeah. Her schedule's on the refrigerator. Did you check? I have a moment on her, please. Thank you. Thank you. Would you mind broadcasting that? around you all the time. You can't ask 
They never fight. I don't like his tone. Now you listen to me. Bianca has a life of her own. No self-respecting woman's going to beat your back and call, mister, and the sooner you learn that, the better. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you're away at your job all day. What's she supposed to do? Wait for you? Would you do that for her? Would she even ask you to? She's out in the community doing things for others less fortunate. You should be proud of her. What about me? Baby, he's just like my husband. She'll be home at 11. Girlfriend, I shouldn't have to check a schedule to see you. You okay? How would she feel if I just left her? Because Ben and her. She didn't abandon you. She'll be back. I know that. People do whatever they want. They don't care. No, we all care. Lars, we do care. No, you don't. That is... That is just not true. God, every person in this town bends over backwards to make Bianca feel at home. Why, why do you think she has so many places to go and so much to do? Huh? Huh? Because of you! Because all these people love you we push your wheelchair we drive her to work we drive her home we wash her we dress her we get her up we put her to bed we carry her and she is not petite lars bianca is a big big girl None of this is easy for any of us, but we do it. Oh, we do it for you. So don't you dare tell me how we don't care. I think it's the person's job who's upset to say that they're upset um, because they can't, you know. Hey. Oh, hey. Hey. How was the game? Yeah, uh, the cheese inspectors beat the crap out of us. Is everything all right? I mean, I usually put Bianca to bed. Yeah, I know. Um, okay, Italian. Well, we wanted to talk to you about that. Um, 
You don't have to do that anymore. I'm going to do that. You sure? Because I don't, I don't mind. And I, I thought that you... Sorry. It's just been one of those days. It's... It's, it's fine, you know what I mean? It's up to you and, and good. Uh, but I'll, I'll leave you, you guys. Hey, Gus. What's that? Thank you, though. I didn't do anything. Yeah, you did. Have you met Eric? Not officially. You're pretty famous around here. Wow. Hell of a grip, too, pal.
talking to Bianca and she was saying that in her culture they have these rites of passages and rituals and ceremonies and just all kinds of things, you know, that when you do them, or at least when you're done, if you live through them, that you know that you're an adult. Doesn't that sound great? It does. How do you know? How do I know what? That you were a man. Nah, I couldn't tell you. Was it? Okay, was it sex? Um. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, it's kind of. It's kind of, no, well, it's kind of sex, but it's but it's not. It's not. Uh, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's a, it's a good good question. Yeah, but I have to know. Hold that thought. You know, you should ask Dagmar. I did ask Dagmar, and she said that I should ask you. Okay, you know, I, I, I can only give you my opinion. That's all I want. Well, it's not like you're all one thing or the other, okay? There's still a kid inside, but you, you, you grow up when you decide to do right. Okay, and not what's right for you, what's right for everybody, even when it hurts. Okay, like what? Like, you know, like, you don't jerk people around, you know, and, 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 and you don't cheat on your woman. And you take care of your family, you know, you admit when you're wrong. Or you try to anyways. That's all I can think of, you know. It, it sounds like it's easy and for some reason it's not. I know, because nothing's easy. It's like the old man. He didn't have to take care of two kids alone. He could have given us to an orphanage or something, you know, people do that. But he loved us and he tried to do right, even though we didn't know how, and even though he had a broken heart. I shouldn't have left you alone with him. He was too sad. It scared me. And I just... I just ran. And that was selfish. And I'm sorry. That's okay. Okay. You've crossed the line. Well, you kept swiping my action figure. I hide them. I don't hang them. Well, whatever, Margot. You're too old for that thing anyway, okay? Take off the noose. No. Take it off. Face it, Margo. The bear is dead. Okay? Burn on you.
I warned her. broke up with Eric. I'm sorry to hear that. <sighs> yeah, you know, I didn't even have a good reason. It wasn't very interesting. Thank you. Hey, what are you doing on Friday? I was just thinking that maybe we could all go out sometime. Never mind. Uh, after I drop off Bianca, I'm free. But it's yeah, just me, so. <laughs> that would be great, Lars. Shred me. 
Hey, buddy! We're full! No problem! God, I, I hope you didn't think that, Lars, I would never do that. And vice versa. Besides, I don't mean to steal anybody's boyfriend. One day I'll find a man of my own and... We'll be happy to. Yeah, that's the way it works, I guess. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
was hoping that winter was over. Mm, no, it's just a thought. Winter isn't over till Easter. Thanks again. Sure, how well these treatments are working. No. What do you think? I don't know. Hmm. I'm sorry. I don't know, it's hard. It's hard because I know that she loves me. She says no. She says I don't know. She didn't say anything. Nothing. I was a child. I spake as a child. I understood as a child.
Oh my god. Bianca! I think she's unconscious. Hey. Are you sure? Bianca. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Bianca's hey. unconscious. Can you hear me? Bianca. Hey, 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 she looks all right. She looks all right. She looks all right. Hey, 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 hey. Call 911. Okay. 911. Well, I don't know. Why do I suspect me to know what to do? They're here. Call Dr. Berman. I see. He is very, very extraordinary. Is he familiar anyone? I'm sorry. You'll have to wait out here. Thank you. I got it. Okay. Hello? Hello? Lars. Uh -huh. Lars. Yeah. Bianca's very sick. <laughs> no, she's not. She's not. Come on, she's not sick. She's not. Lars? She's dying. But. God. We're gonna keep her here till she's stable, but. She wants to go home with Lars tonight. Can I see her? Sure. I'm sorry, but I I just don't get it. I I don't. I mean, what's this gonna do to him? How could you let this happen? Well, I'm not letting it happen. It's Lars. It's always been Lars. He's making the decisions. He's the one who found her unconscious. He's the one who said she's dying.
We sent Gus and Karen to the movies. They didn't want to leave you two. This is happening so close to the baby coming. And that's how life is, Lars. Everything at once. We brought casseroles. Thank you. Is there something that I should be doing right now? No, dear. You eat. We came over to sit. That's what people do when tragedy strikes. They come over and sit. Don't you feel a little better? I got spring fever. We're going to the lake. You want to come? Hey, Lars. Why don't you come with us? Do everybody good. Bianca, don't you want to see this beautiful day? Is there a storm coming? Weather said no. It looks like a storm to me. Well, I need to stretch my legs. Let's take a chance. Lars. I think we're going to watch the water. Well, we won't be far. All of you need this.